All right, so um, hands down, uh, in the beginning, it was, it was the innkeeper and I connected, right? I mean, bringing tears to my, to my eyes. Of course, we're in the dark and nobody can see it, so it's a good thing. And I'm back there listening to a really good friend of mine perform the part of the innkeeper. And uh, it resonated with me because I was, at that time in my life, just knee deep and in life, knee deep in a demanding job and things that just kept my life hairy. <clears throat> so um, since then, I, I've made some changes. Maybe thanks to the innkeeper, um, that uh, I don't have that same hairy, demanding commitment on me that keeps me from my family, etc. Uh, you know, I shaved my head. I grew a beard. You know, here I am in front of the Clark Griswold tree. Uh, I think today um, I'm probably resonating more with uh, with with the shepherd because that's who I've always been and I think I'll always be the shepherd and I'm comfortable with that matter of fact if I was not the shepherd I would be bored so uh, you need to check it out and see what I'm talking about all right so uh, okay growing up um, I was the only child you know and, and, and having them, my parents there all the time you know, it was great I had two awesome parents and they're still awesome um, but as a kid growing up, I enjoyed, once I kind of got into my into myself, um, older in my age, not old enough to be mature yet, right? Which I think I'm still there. But I love going out in my best friend's front yard, I don't know, right around the Thanksgiving time <clears throat> and waiting for the train. We'd wait for the train all night long. Sometimes it would take all night for the train to come. Just the sound of that train rushing by their house, the tracks were right beside the house. I used to love that. I always associated that with my holiday time with my best friends because I had no brothers. You know, they were my brothers. Now that I'm old enough and I have, um, or older and I have kids, um, I love, I love, and my wife will tell you, staying up all night sometimes, preparing the house for the next day. Christmas Eve, staying up all night, building toys and getting stuff ready. Doesn't matter how tired I am, I'm excited about it. So, there you go.